Hey guys, welcome to SP Labs. Uh, so in this episode, what we are going to learn uh, is how to show uh, wireframe overlay inside Blender. Uh, so as you all of uh, you are coming from 3ds Max, uh, you must be knowing like how to activate it. It is just a keyboard toggle. Uh, it is if you want to show the wireframe on shaded, like like what what you're seeing here, uh, you just press uh, F4 key on the on the keyboard uh, so it is that easy so press uh, press f4 to toggle the uh, the white frame on shaded on and then again press the f4 to toggle it off or you can also find that in the under default shading then use use uh, edge faces so it is actually a uh, to toggle is much more easier than than uh, than the edge edge faces also you can change the white frame color just by going to this um, color palette just to the right of uh, this object name click on it and if i want to change that to red just select it and and the wireframe color is red so it is that easy so so you so you all of you must be knowing uh, about this also um, i'm assuming that uh, all of you are coming from a max background and also you have a fairly good idea about how max uh, how 3 ds max works now let's do the same thing inside Blender. So when I started Blender, uh, it was very difficult for me to find out where this option is. So I had to search uh, Google and then find some videos on YouTube just to get the idea uh, to find out, figure out where this uh, wireframe on shaded was. Uh, so it is uh, it is relatively easy uh, inside Blender. Uh, only thing is that you need to set up a shortcut key a key for it. By default, it won't be uh, showing a shortcut key. Uh, but but you can uh, you can customize it so how do you find it so first of all you need to go into the shade, shade, shaded mode so viewport shading go into solid so, so the first first one is wireframe if you click it'll be wireframe second one is uh, the viewport shading uh, shading a uh, solid mode so go into solid mode and under so uh, once you are in solid mode open this viewport overlays menu over here and you can find a wireframe checkbox so just click that on you can you can see that now the objects are showing uh, uh, with a wireframe overlay so this is the uh, first step now um, now how will you change the uh, the the wireframe overlay color so for that you need to go into preferences go to edit preferences and go into uh, themes uh, then 3d viewport then uh, so so these are like, like all the colors you you adjust uh, on uh, like which 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 show up on the 3D view, view, viewport. So 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 there is something called wire. So this wire color. So this this is the color that that will be shown uh, on the wireframe overlay. So click on this, and when you when you change it, like I will change to white. You can see that the the colors have been up, updated to white. It is uh, it is it is that easy. I usually use black for all my projects uh, because I find white a little bit uh, too uh, obstructive. Uh, so that uh, so that's it. Also, if you want to save save the uh, save the preferences, you can you can go into this small menu over here and use save uh, pre 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 uh, preferences. If you want to save it manually, but if you keep the auto save pre uh, preferences on, it will save each time you change it. So that is pretty much it for the uh, wireframe overlay inside blender thank you so much guys thanks for watching